everyone. I just want to bring you an update on my backpack. It's changed quite a bit since I stopped going to school, so here we go. Um, on this strap here, we've got some mace and a lighter, just for quick access. It's also wrapped in duct tape. This is a quick release. I can pull it off here. These are just keychains, but I have them on here just for fun, but if I need to take them off, they're all attached just with one carabiner, so it's really easy to just click those on and off. Um, over here, this is a hand crank flashlight. This is a ferro rod and steel. The steel's not very good, but I have my knife that I can use. This is a four in one. It's a whistle, um, a temperature gauge, this unscrews, and there's a mirror, and then it's also a container. And in the center of the container, I have some spare cash, and that right there in the middle is a clear produce bag from the grocery store. I'll post the link, but there's a guy who does really great videos about all the different things you can do with those. Um, and then this is just an extra hair tie, but this comes off and on. These things I got with some other stuff for Christmas in a kit. So if we pull the backpack open, this is the main compartment. There's not really anything in here ever except my computer, so I leave that empty, and my planner. All right. So pocket here, I keep a stainless steel bottle uh, so that I can boil it if I need to. In there, just real, got it from a friend. So this bag I got for free because someone got it at an event and didn't want it and gave it to me. So that's why it says AT&T. Alright, so in here, this is the front pouch. We've got several different um, types of items. This is, I did another pro uh, video on this. It's just, it's a calming thing. I get anxiety. You shake it up, you watch the glitter. It weighs a couple ounces. It makes me feel better. And to me, I feel like part of preparing is knowing yourself and being introspective. And if I need something to focus on when I'm, you know, anxious, I have it. I have a buck knife that I got. Um, I can't make it do that thing because I'm not good at that. But this is the first knife I ever had. It's a little, it's still pretty sharp. It could be sharpened, but whatever. That's my cat. Um, down in the bottom, I don't have anything loose, but I got a couple things in here. So this is a mag light with a little bit of duct tape. This is contact solution. It is really bright in here. I don't know what's going on with the light. Um, contact solution, because I wear contacts, so I need to have that. Hand sanitizer. I'm not one of those people who's all into sanitizing your hands, but sometimes you, you need to and a tampon. Normally there's there's another one in the bottom too. All right, and then in the back pocket here, I have, this is my beanie. It's pretty warm, I like it a lot. I have it there um, for a couple different reasons. I wear it if it's cold, but if I am carrying water or something in that produce bag, I actually put the bag in the hat as a liner so it makes it a lot stronger and then this is all the rest of the stuff that came with the things in my uh, on the strap there so two water pouches for extra water carrying space blanket in the back of the space blanket I put some hand warmers that I just got at a gas station this is a compass it's a map compass for reading maps, I guess. And then I also have in a plastic bag because I don't want it to get wet. The U.S. Army Survival Manual that came with all that stuff. Um, and this also, I checked it very thoroughly to make sure it doesn't have holes in it. And if I needed, like if it was raining, I could put it over my beanie. And it would look silly, but it would keep my head dry. Which trumps silly. 
Alright, so then you have this second pocket here. Um, this is just a light that I got for Christmas. If I'm walking around in the dark or I set my bag down, it's kind of just a little glow light to help me see it. So I put that on there. This is my Altoids tin. I did a, rev I did a thing on this um, before, so you can check that out. My deodorant. Yes, I wear men's deodorant because it works better. Um, this is my wallet that I made from something else. This is where I keep some of my cards and stuff. Um, this is a little notebook. That right there is a pencil. And then there's a little baggie and some band-aids and stuff in there. And these are my headphones. Because it helps keep them nice and neat. And then I have a Sharpie. And then when I have my computer, my portable mouse also goes in there. And then the last thing... Well, not the last thing, sorry. Second to last thing. This is not a first aid kit, but it is a tin that I got a first aid kit in. And this is like my overnight bag. I've done some stuff on this that hasn't really changed. It's just basically stuff I need because we spend a lot of nights out of town in different people's places. This, I got at the gas station. I love, love, love Vicks Vapor Rub, but the tins are always too big for me to carry around. And then I found this little mini one, so I was really happy about that. Um, so I put that in there. So toothbrush, toothpaste, um, razor, hairspray. This is soaps and lotions, soap. Um, you know, different kind of things. I mean, there's a lot packed in there. The whole thing is full, but it's just that kind of stuff. Nothing tactical. None of my stuff's really tactical, but I've got in there, I've got like a trash bag and a Ziploc so that, you know, I don't know, I could make a poncho or something. Um, this is the first part of a first aid kit. You can see there's band-aids in there, some tape, Tiger Bomb, band-aids, um, gloves at the top right there if I need some gloves, and some Listerine mouth thingies. Um, and here I have, same thing, some Peptos, an Ace bandage, some gauzes, some tape. I'm sorry about the glare, it's really bad. Um, and then this is also my food compartment. I have some almonds, which I love. And I have a little pack here, some peanuts, um, that's a little stir, st stick stir, cliff bars, some um, tea, and some lara bars. So that's what I keep with me. Normally, like I said, I'll have my computer um, and the water bottle, which I didn't show. And then I have the different stuff that I keep in my pockets. I have a very mini Altoids tin with some different stuff that's this size, but it's got a whole bunch of different stuff in it. And then um, I always have a knife in my pocket, that kind of stuff. So this is what I keep with me when I, when I go. Not very tactical, just kind of every day on the go. And then I could use it, I guess, in some situations. I'm working on building it up, but I don't tend to find mice. I don't go camping or anything um, but with everything with the weather that's been going on lately I'm really working on getting some at-home um, prep stuff and some you know stuff that I can keep with me like you know if we get stranded on the highway because it's snowing I mean that's a very real thing you know everything that happened on the east coast so um, you know trying to kind of get get some of that stuff so anyway these are my shoes that I'm playing with because I'm not talking. Anyway, alright. Thanks, guys. Bye.